Good evening, everybody. Please turn on your cameras. Don't forget, that's important. Good evening, teacher. Hey, what's up? How are you, Andres? I'm good. Great, great. How's the weather? It's uh, very cool. Cold? Not cool. No, not cool, cold, cool. but, but cool. cool. Uh, uh, Good to hear. Francisco, Jocelyn, Blanca, Sandra, Erika. Good evening, guys. Erwin. Hey, teacher, how are you? I'm doing great. I've mm -hmm. been working all day on the golf. I golf? haven't, I haven't told you yet. I had a big problem with the, the culata. Oops, the cool. How? Yeah, the previous the previous owner used to put just water, you know, or or very cheap coolant. Yes. And so the main seal, the main seal of the culata just broke and it was filtering water with oil. And so I had to send it, I had to send it to the um to these guys to the repair shop, you know, and so far, I have invested like seven hundred dollars. Seven hundred dollars. But I mean, the engine is perfect now. The engine is perfect. I just changed um, a return, you know, yes. uh, a little uh, seal from the transmission um, shifter. El yep. selector. How can it, what, what was the name of it? Oh my God. Uh, it is, el eje, el eje selector, el eje it is, you know? it is a, a good problem in the golf. Yeah, yeah, but it's it's going great. I mean, I was able to find the, the parts, and so that's good. I didn't find a, a an oil pump, the oil pump. I didn't find Oof. it, but it's working well. Yeah, I, wa I wanted to change it. I wanted to change it, but I couldn't find it. But anyways, it's running well. It's running well, and that's what matters. So. So for you. No, no, I'm very happy actually because I, I have a lot of work to do on the car. <laughs> oh my god. And it's going and it's going really good actually. Anyhow. Yeah, you will have seen me today. I, I looked like black, you know, with all the oil. My hands were black. It was crazy. I love that. That's my yes. hobby. That's my hobby. Okay, guys, it's 804 already. 804. We're going to start today with a quiz, a test. You love tests, right? Exams. Oh. <laughs> really? Really? Yeah, it's going to be fun. Don't worry. It's just simple questions about yesterday's topic, just so we can refresh a little bit, you know, what we talked about yesterday. Don't worry. It's easy. It's just six questions. Well, so far I have, let me see, two, four. Yeah, I only have six questions so far. I'm gonna add two more. Okay, three more. There's gonna be nine questions on this quiz. Before we jump into the quiz, I'm going to do the attendance now that we are 20. Welcome, guys. Today is Wednesday, January 26th. Tomorrow. Okay. I'm turning 40. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Excellent. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present, teacher. Thank you. Give me one second. Sorry. Um, Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Perfect. Excellent, Doris or oh, Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Excellent, 
Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chávez. Present. Freddy Vladimir Cortés López. I'm here. Great. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present, teacher. Excellent. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Okay. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present, teacher. Excellent. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Yeah. Excellent. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Good. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sanchez. Present. Excellent. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Hope you're doing better. Jessica Yanira Cortez Diaz. I'm here with Janari teacher. Oh my God, wait, Jessica Yanari Cortez Diaz. Sorry, Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. I saw Jocelyn here somewhere. Yep, there she is. Can hear you. Okay, I got you. I got you, Jocelyn. Um, Roberto Luis Omaño Orellana, Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Excellent. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Okay. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present teacher. Good. Telma Clotilde Peña Martinez. There she is. Yeah, you fixed the camera. <laughs> Good girl. Great job. Okay. So today we're gonna do something here. Teacher, teacher. Hey, hey. Pre present, sorry. Yeah, it's okay. okay. I got your win. Okay. Okay. So let me see. We have Andres. Doris. Erika, Fredis, Luis Ernesto. Freddy's, that's with the Y. No, it's with an I. Don't forget to put your full name, please, on the camera. Luis Fernando Edwin. We have Edwin, Stephanie, Alexander. See, sí, I'm almost done. Sorry, Jessica, Josue, Suleima. Mm -hmm. Telma, Sandra, Irwin. Jocelyn Blanca. Who's connecting? Glenda. Jocelyn Blanca, Glenda. Okay. Wow. Okay. Glenda Francisco Jarvin. Oh, Jarvin, almost like Jarvis, Jarvis. That's a dream that I have, Erwin, to put the voice of Jarvis on the golf, you know, <laughs> and go like, welcome, Rafael, or welcome, Tony. <laughs> that would be <laughs> awesome. <laughs> yeah, and the car is red, so I'm thinking about painting it like, you know, Iron Man red and gold <laughs> that would be awesome okay so 
Let's choose a few words, I mean, a few questions. Okay, shall we? Let me hide this menu. Okay. Uh oh, I didn't want to click on that yet. Okay, let's choose one of you to answer the first question. <laughs> this is just related to yesterday, Luis. Okay. Hi. We're gonna start with Luis Ernesto today, tonight. First question. Oh, okay. Tell me about a classmate that you remember yesterday. Tell me about one of your classmates. I think about Josue. Josue? Um, okay. Yeah, Josue Alberto, yes. Mm -hmm. um, he uh, worked at um, oh, a scanner operator, something like that, and he, he lived in, I'm not sure, Chalatenango, I think. Um, what else? Um, uh, I think he's studying at the university, he's still studying at the university. Um, <laughs> okay, <is> that? <laughs> that's it, okay, yeah, he works as a scanner operator. Josue Alberto is not in his chair. Okay, good job, Luis, thank you very much. Let's go with okay. someone else, great job. Okay, I just have six, um, let's see, nine questions. That was one of them. We have... Andres. Andres Giovanni. Okay, Andres. Tell the class. Oh, look at that. What is e-commerce in your own words? What is e-commerce? E-commerce is uh, it's a uh, sales in on the internet okay. uh, there are different websites that you can you can use to buy and the companies have a, a big opportunity to have more customers by this way okay through this is a method so it is a method or a way of purchasing items, purchasing goods. Okay, mm -hmm. totally. Excellent, very good. Easy, you see, simple exam. Thank you, thank you, Andres, thank you, Luis. Let's see who is next. Josue. <laughs> okay. Josue, if you're close, if you're around, please come to the front. He had stood from his chair. I noticed he said stood from his chair. Stood up. No, there he is. Hey, Josue, turn on your microphone and tell the class. Hello, teacher. Hey, what's up? Okay, we were talking about you, but you were not there. So answer the following question, Josue. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tell the class, tell me about your Christmas. Tell us about your Christmas, your vacation. How was it? Um, my Christmas, um, I, I live in Chalatunango for my job. But in Christmas, I visit my relatives, my mom, my grandma. And I spend time with, with them. And it was awesome. I... <sighs> Mm, mess uh, to have the the time to to have a a meal with my mom and my other relatives. Then was a good time with with them. Okay, simple. Thank you very much. 
I'm in Chalatenango for my job. Mm, because of my job. Sounds better. Because of my job. Good job. Okay. Let's go with the next question. The next participant. Oh, Thelma. <laughs> Something easy. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Okay. Hmm. Oh, okay. Thelma, if you can turn on your microphone. Okay. We cannot hear you. It was on, there you go, say something. Sing a song from Journey. Sing a song from Journey. Can you hear me? Yeah. A Journey song. No, her microphone. Your microphone is, is on, but we cannot hear you. No? Yes, there you go, okay, beautiful voice. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is the most dangerous, dangerous thing that could, could happen? happen when you buy it online. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, that my that the eating is is uh, uh, is different, mm -hmm. and you wait for a long time, and oh. then what happened? It's different. <laughs> my my article is different. Ah. Uh, and I, I okay feel... when they deliver the wrong item. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Oh my God! Do you think that's the most dangerous? That's the worst. That's the worst that could happen. Not even the worst, but dangerous. Something dangerous that could happen to you if you make an online purchase. Think, think, think. Uh, hmm. uh, toxic product <laughs> into the the item. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That it's could the be. the most for, for example, uh, daddy eating have a. <gasps> I got uh, you. I got your toxic. point. Toxic. Get, getting intoxicated, uh, poisoned yeah. by um, by something you bought online. Okay, that's dangerous, true. Okay, yeah. I want someone else to support this idea. Someone else? What do you mm. think is dangerous when you buy online? Uh, I think that uh, other people can steal your information yes. for credit cards or your bank account. Yeah, identity theft, identity, identity, identity theft. Ah, okay. Theft. It's about uh, uh -huh. situation. The situation. Into the okay, into the into the buying. Okay, and the fraud. Yes, and fraud. Is is uh, is dangerous, no? Yeah, and it's very common. Right now, that's very common. Excellent. Thank you, honey. Let's go with someone else. <clears throat> Erwin. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Okay, let's go with your question. Oh, okay. Mention. One consumer disadvantage of e-commerce not the one we just mentioned but mention something else a disadvantage as a customer of e-commerce uh, the really with my own with my own words in your own words in your own okay. words what, what do you think okay. is at a disadvantage as a customer the scam 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 yes mm. they can scam the person the customer how? Because you will pay with the credit card. And many times, well, many years ago, there are many, there was 
there were many problems with the scheme because many people try to take the information your credit card. Many people try to steal yes. the information from your credit card. Yes, yes. totally. The credit card. That's called yes. personal yes. data. Yes. Many the company can can give you the change the product in that moment, okay? But mm -hmm. uh, if you have a, pro, a bad problem, a, a bad product, uh, the company will can change. But the problem, the most problem, is the scheme. Hmm. Because they can steal the information in the scheme. Scam. Because, scam, sorry, scam. Mm -hmm. Because your information in the credit card is so important. Totally. Okay. While we're doing this, everybody else try to find synonyms for scam. Yes. Everybody else try to find synonyms for scam. This is the topic that we're talking about right now. Okay, thank you, Irwin. Let's go with someone else and select a different question. Jarvin, thank you. Hey, Jarvin, turn on your microphone and camera. Hey. Okay, let's go with your question. Oh, mention, okay. Mention one business advantage of e-commerce. One business advantage of e-commerce. Maybe the sales improved? Increase? In, increasing sales, sales increasing? Yes. Why? Yes. Because you have to, you can connect with another customer that are not in your place, in the same country, or, or, or the customer can buy wherever they were. They are, sorry. They want? Yes. Whatever they want. Yeah. Yeah, totally. I agree with you. Yeah, your uh, products, you have a wider, a wider variety of products. Yeah. And in fact, um, that's something we talked about on Intermediate 2, I think. Uh, when you uh, sell more than one product, you diversificate, let's say you, you become a seller for different products. You may sell batteries, but with e-commerce, you can actually sell other accessories for vehicles if you uh, partnership with someone else. What was the name of that, guys? Let's see who remembers. What is the name when you, <laughs> that is one of the four, no, the, the five C, the, five, the seven Cs, the seven Cs, remember the seven Cs. Uh, when you have a brand, remember, and you find another um, business that sells a similar product to yours. How do you call that C? Do you remember, guys? Thank you, Jarvin. Competitors? <laughs> no, remember the four Cs, the seven Cs. Co? Co-branding. Yay! Oh, my God. Look at him. Oh, my God. <laughs> Such a distinguished gentleman. Very good. <laughs> Great job. Okay. Co-branding. That's right. Who's here, Fernando? Okay, we have Fernando. Okay. Hey. Okay, let's see what's your question, buddy. Hey guys, go continue with the chat. Give me more synonyms for fraud, for scam. Okay, tell me about someone that is new for you in the class. Uh <coughs> What, do, do you want the name or yeah what means uh, let me see uh, Edwin Alexander Ayalerazo. Mm. okay what what what's there to say about Edwin uh, 
I remember I was with him in a, in a break room, but we don't. We didn't. Uh, we did. We didn't talk a lot, so I don't know much of my new. Uh, on my news, uh, uh, mates. You didn't know much about him. Okay. Yes. Who do you remember? Uh, I remember Edwin. I remember, let me, uh, <laughs> yesterday I was with Jocelyn, but Jocelyn no, isn't new. <laughs> Somebody was not paying attention to the introductions at the beginning of the class. Okay. <laughs> ah. <laughs> well, was a lot of uh, describes. So I I didn't remember all the the news. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my God! Thank you, Sulema. It's a lot of synonyms, although some of them I never heard of. Hmm. Bundugul. What? Bundugul. That's, that's new for me. Bundugul. Okay. Thank you, Fer. Let's go with another question. We're almost done. Sandra. Okay. Sandra, please turn on your microphone and camera. Diddle. Diddle. Okay. Sandra. Mention one business disadvantage of e-commerce. A business disadvantage of e-commerce. What is wrong for businesses on e-commerce? Remember yesterday's short video? There was a short video about pros and cons. Yeah. Sandra? Okay, I'm going to choose someone else. We need to move on. Same question for Jessica. Okay, Jessica. Um, and maybe a dis dis disadvantage, right, teacher? A, a disadvantage. Disadvantage, disadvantage. Right. for Thank you. business. Mm -hmm. uh, wait for the product? Mm, no, as a business, as a business, remember? Oh, uh, no, 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 no. If, if, I don't remember, teacher. Mm -hmm. It was many, it was many, but I saw the. There were the many, uh -huh. there were yeah. many. Yeah. Okay, help, help. Hacking, being hacking. Being hacked. 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 Oh, you mean that somebody can create a fake website of your business and start scamming people, right? Yeah, and lack of um, legal support. Uh, Le I, um, lack of legal support. Yeah. If you are an entrepreneur and you do e-commerce, you may be in lack of legal support. Great word, lack of. Good job, thank you. Okay, there are many things that could happen to you as a business if you go on e-commerce and you don't know what you're doing. So always getting, adv getting advice is very important. Oh, 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 Doris. Okay, Doris. Okay, mention one consumer disadvantage of e-commerce, a consumer disadvantage. We already said being scammed, having your data stolen, your credit card information stolen. What else is a disadvantage? Um, I think uh, uh, when uh, I, I bought in online uh, in the screen, uh, the products, uh, so uh, so beautiful the colors the size but when i receive the article is so different yes. okay <laughs> totally yeah you get you get something else not what you ordered hey repeat receive 
receive receive receive receive mm -hmm. second word article article perfect not article article mm. article, no. article 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 okay got it thank you two more questions to go and we finish erica <laughs> Okay, Erika, we only have two more questions. Okay. Mention one consumer advantage of e-commerce. Oh my God, this is so easy. A consumer advantage of e-commerce, Erika. Okay, I think one of advantage is you can uh, find uh, several options of the product you are looking for in one place. You can find several options for the product that you're looking for in the same place. Totally, yes. totally. Uh, one of advantage, one of the advantages, repeat. Okay, one of the advantages. Uh -huh. Excellent. Okay. You know, you know something you. that I like when I buy something online, the first thing that I do is check the reviews. Check yes. the, the, the other other people buying the same product, you know, what do they say about it, you know, and what's the rating, the rating for that item that's important, guys. And I always go to the negative side of it. <laughs> okay, let's see. Francisco, tell yes. me, tell me about your hobby. What's your favorite? thing in the world okay it's a little crazy but it's it's true <laughs> okay. my favorite hobby is sleep there's nothing crazy about it i think we all have that hobby <laughs> <laughs> how often how often do you practice it <laughs> uh, when i have an opportunity oh so not every day mm. yes yeah of course um, <laughs> right now yes. for example no, 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 no. Hey, don't fall asleep, guys. I hope I'm, this is not a boring class, okay? No, so, no, no, no. Okay. Tonight, we have to continue with your content on page nine, but we will also cover, we're going to talk about um, always related to e-commerce, of course, but this time um, we have to exemplify different types of e-businesses. Um as we were talking with Irwin yesterday and everybody, uh, e-commerce is like the general thing, you know, e-commerce, electronic commerce. Um, it's the evolution of physical to electronic or the web thing. And this is evolving, by the way, with the metaverse. Have you heard of the metaverse? Yeah, right. No, yeah, kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, th what is what is the metaverse? Someone, in your own words. Virtual world. What? <laughs> virtual world. A virtual virtual world. Virtual world. 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 <laughs> difficult. <laughs> difficult, right? Word. World. 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 <laughs> Excellent. Tu, tu lengua se va para atrás y mientras la soltas, soltas la L. World, world. Yeah, a virtual world now, very soon. And this is the future of e-commerce. You will be able to go to a physical store with the metaverse, see the product, you know, not try it, not try it, taste it, mm -mm. But see it, you know, how it works. It's like going to uh, any store, right? And you go like, hey, what is this? How does but it actually, work? Mm -hmm. But actually, if Facebook, Facebook is, has been creating a, a, how this, a globe, globe, like a globe, in order to feel the, sen the sense, yours, yeah? Like the things, like if you are physical in the moment, touch it. Yeah, eventually we will reach that level of craziness. They are creating, actually. 
Yeah, sensors. Sensors yeah. for your taste, your hear, your sight. It's crazy. But yeah, the point is that, that for me, from my point of view, that's the future of e-commerce. Now, um, e-businesses, e-businesses is just the kind of, how can I say this? The kind of transaction. If the transaction goes from customer to customer, from business to customer, from business to business, and so on. It's six different types of um, e-businesses that we're going to talk about them today in groups. So I'll split you in six groups somehow, and you will tell the whole class what is your e-business about, okay? We will see it. So just to move on with the topic, let's go to page nine. And I'm going to show you something that I like to do in the classes. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm so ugly. I'm awful. I am so ugly that I like to show my mouth, my ugly mouth. And this is the way I do it. Just a minute. I have to make this bigger. So, el punto de esto, y solo esta vez lo voy a decir, perdón que hable español, pero que quede claro, ustedes pueden volver a revisar el video este en YouTube. Yo trataré de enviarles ese link siempre al WhatsApp para que ustedes vuelvan al video y se muevan hasta este minuto. No sé en qué minuto vamos, pero pueden volver a este minuto de la grabación y pues vamos al minuto 37, ¿ok? So, pueden volver a este minuto y revisar la pronunciación, ok, en este momento todos en silencio and just listen and follow the reading my friend and I would like to start an e-commerce website for our handicrafts 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 they sell well at the farmer's market but we want to sell to people who don't visit us, who don't visit us here on the countryside. I see there are many advantages, advantages to an e-commerce website. For instance, for instance, customers can buy your products 24 seven through, through, an automated, an automated platform. And they are also able to compare products and prices. That's exactly what we need. But are there any drawbacks, drawbacks to this e-commerce thing? Well, you may want to let a different company handle the shipping to the shipping and storage of your products. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving in bad conditions or not arriving at all, at all, at all, which makes consumers disappointed, disappointed, disappointed. Okay. It's your turn. I need two volunteers, say me and your name. Me, Alexander. Oh, me, Alexander. One else? Me, Fernando. One. Me, Fernando. Me, Alexander. Me, Fernando. One, two, three, go. My friend and I would like to start an e commerce website for. Oh, I can. Okay. <laughs> Again, my friend and. Sorry. My friend and I would like to start an e commerce website for our handicrafts they sell well at the farmers market but we want to sell to people who don't visit us here on the countryside i see there are many advantages to an e-commerce website for instance customer can buy your products 24 uh, 7 through an automatic platform and they are also able to compare products and prices. That's exactly what I, what we need. 
but are there any drawbacks the, to this e-commerce thing? Well, you may want to leave a different company hand to the shipping and storage of your products. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving in bad condition or not arriving at all, which makes consumers disappointed. Okay, good job, guys. Thank you. Let's repeat, everybody. Advantages. 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 Excellent. Advantages. 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 Okay, next. Through. 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 Yeah, exactly. Through. 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 There you go. Automated. 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 Oh, oh. Automated. Automated platform. Automated plat platform. Automated system. Automated system. Got it? Good job. Next, handle. 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 Yeah, this comes from hand for hand. Hun handle. There you go. Handle. And that's it. Oh, conditions. Remember, condition, conditions, education. Okay. Education. Conditions. Perfect. Conditions, condition. That that sound is in many words. Education, procrastination, visualization, apprendation, and all, all of these words, right? Okay. They end with shen, 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 shen. Ahorita de shen, later you will say shen, okay? It's difficult. It's different. Okay. I'm going to send you in groups to practice this just for eight minutes. Okay. It's just reading. One is Lucas, one is Sol, and then you switch and someone else does it. The other person pays attention. Any questions on the vocabulary? Okay. Mm -hmm. So everybody knows the words. What is the countryside? Like a, like a border. Um, a border. Wow. Mm -hmm. Handicrafts. Good. Thank you. What is handicrafts? Como manualidades. Thank you, beautiful Spanish. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to use Spanish neither. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Using, Artesanías, eh? Yes, another beautiful word in Spanish. Yes. <laughs> Synonyms. Come on. Uh huh. Handicrafts is like things made with your hands. Artesanías. What? Manualidades? Not manualidades, right? What do you think? Yeah. Manualidades. Okay. But things that you can sell, of course. Okay. Countryside. Where's the countryside of the city? What is the countryside in San Salvador? Uh, sector del Rey. Yeah, it's a, is a, is a, uh, the border. It's a rural, rural place. Rural. rural. You can rural. say it. Rural area. Far from the Oh, okay. Far from? Yes, far from the city. Far away from the city. This is the first way you communicate in English when you don't know what to say. Use your words. Use the vocabulary that you know already. Aside from the city, is far away from the city is a place where there's no internet maybe or no cell phones you know there's not much education sometimes yeah the countryside teacher, okay mm -hmm. teacher um i looked that that word in the translator google translated but appears uh, only one word not two for example countryside there's not a space Oh, there's not that. a space. Mm -hmm. Thank you for clarifying that. Mm -hmm. 
I've always written that word separated. That's really weird. Weird. But okay, no space. Countryside. Yeah. Okay. And what's the meaning, Sule? Uh, in Spanish? Yeah. Campo or campiña. Yeah, el campo. Okay. Drawbacks. That's exactly what we need, but are there any drawbacks to this e-commerce thing? Problems? Do you remember? Problems is a synonym for problems. Any drawbacks, any kickbacks? Issues. Any issues. Uh huh. But return to you. You know, problems that come from this situation. Okay. So if I do e-commerce, are there any drawbacks? Drawbacks. Okay. Those were like the main words, you know, that I needed you to take note of. Anybody else? Any other word? That's it? Okay. Let's get split it just for no more than 10 minutes. Work together and talk, 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 talk. Practice, practice, practice. Let's go. You may share your, your book. Hi, Liz. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Who wants who wants to start? Uh, um, we are first. four <laughs> guys. Four guys. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe uh, at the first time, uh, Luis and Glenda. Okay. Um. Let me see my manual. Give me one second, please. Okay, <clears throat> I start. My friend and I would like to start an e commerce website for our handicrafts. They sell well at the farmer market, but we want to sell to people who can visit us here on the country. I see there are many advantages to an e-commerce website. For instance, customers can buy products 24-7 to an automated platform, and they are also able to compare products and price. That's exactly what uh, we need, but are there any drawbacks to this e-commerce thing? Well, you may want to leave a different company handling the shipping and storage of your product. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving and bad conditions are not arriving at all, which makes consumers disappointed. Okay, thank you. Uh, I think uh, Edwin and Tim. Okay. Okay. Hello, uh, Kevin. Hello, Thelma. How are you? Um, okay, let me start. My friend and I would like to start an e-commerce website for our handicraft. They sell well at the farmer's market, but we want to sell to people who don't visit us here on the countryside. I see. There are many advantages to an e-commerce website. For instance, customers can buy your product 24 7 through an automatic platform. And they are also able to compare products and prices. That's exactly why we need, what we need. But are there many drawbacks to this e commerce thing? Any? But we are, but we are there any drawbacks to this to these e-commerce things? Well, you may want to let a different company handle to shipping 
storage of your products. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving in bad conditions or not arriving at all, which mark with make which makes customers disappointed. Okay, repeat at all, at all, at all. At all. Remember Adele. At all, at all. It's part of a song. <laughs> song, yeah. And and also you say disappointed. 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 Mm -hmm. You can say disappointed, and that's more British. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Good job. Keep going. Okay. Switching to turn, Andres. I don't know if you are in the in the group. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. Now I don't know if William want okay. to. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Yes. William, oh. I can practice with you. William, with me. Okay. Okay, okay. good. Okay, I will be Lucas. My friend and I would like to start an e-commerce website for our, for our handicraft. They sell well at the farmer's market, but we want to sell to people who don't visit us here on the countryside. I see uh, there are many advantages to an e-commerce website. For instance, customers can buy your products 24 or seven through an automated platform. And they are also able to compare products and prices. That's exactly what we need. But are there any drawbacks to this e-commerce thing? Well, you may want to, to let a different company handle to shipping and storage of your product. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving in bad condition or not arriving at all, which makes consumers disappointed. Okay, thank you, William. Thank you. Jarvin, if you want, I okay. will be Saul this time and you will be Lucas. Okay. My friends and I would like to start an e-commerce website for our handicraft. They sell well at the farmer's market, but we want to sell to people who don't visit us here on the countryside. I see. There are many advantages to an e-commerce website. For instance, customers can buy your products 24-7 through an automated, automated <laughs> platform, and they are also able to compare products and prices. That's exactly what we need. But are there any drawbacks to the, this e-commerce thing? Well, you may want to let a different company handle the shipping and storage of your products. Then there is the risk of shipping arriving in bad conditions or not arriving at all, which makes consumers disappointed. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Amos and Jocelyn, you can switch your role, please, and do it again. Uh, okay, I will what? be Lucas. You, you were Amos, and sorry, you were Lucas last last time, right? Okay, I will be Lucas. Risk of shipping arriving in bad condition or not arriving at all, which which may consumer disappointed. Okay. <laughs> what are the words that is the most difficult for us? <sighs> Dra drug box is automated. That's a compound That's word. Right. It's not draw, it's draw. Draw. Drawback. And then you have back, yeah, drawback, drawbacks, drawbacks. Okay. Drawbacks. Okay. Mm -hmm. Automated is right. Oh, auto. 
Disappointed. What is this? Disappointed. Bien, eh, una observación, siempre que lo llame de regreso a las, acá a la sesión principal, no quedarse por allá platicando, <ríe> no es un recreo, <ríe> sí, eh, pero sí, regresar rapidito, nomás veas que te aparece el, el, la solicitud de regresar a la sesión principal, dale clic, ok, o oh, tap, with your fingertip, um, tengo do, dos minutos, Áreas de oportunidad de este grupo, áreas de oportunidad en general, en intermedio, siempre son las mismas. Primer lugar, y lo más común, voy de lo más común a lo más simple, lo, lo menos común. Lo más común, final sounds. Final sounds. What is final sounds? ¿Qué son final sounds? Ok. Mi talón de aquí les dijo alguno por ahí. Sí, 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 yo sé. Okay, advantage, advantages, advantages, advantages. Lie, ya a este punto ya no puedes decir lie. This is like, like, k, 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 k. ojo. Y esos son los sonidos finales. K, 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 k. Cada palabra en inglés, cada palabra en español tiene un sonido final. Vea. Oh, verdad. Right. <laughs> okay. So the same thing. Uh -huh. También no es right. Right? Right? Right. Right? Friend? Right. My, my friend. My friend. Mm. What is it? Friend. My friend. Right? Okay. Okay. Let's start the session. Let's start, start. the session. Let's start. Okay. Okay. Our or our. Esto, es, esto hasta esto puede ser un poco difícil, pero práctica. Oído, oído, oído. Acuérdate, esa es tu comida ahorita. Los sonidos son tu comida, ¿ok? Producilo, reproducilo. Volvete un perfecto imitador. Ocupa toda tu, tu boca. Uh, second part, la segunda parte. Uh -huh. Ya. Yeah. Tercera persona. Presente simple. Tercera persona. She tell me or she tells me. She tells me. Mm -hmm. Be careful. Okay. Oh. Eso, eso. Terceras personas. Oraciones positivas. Terceras personas. He, she, it. Yo modifico el verbo, le agrego S y ES. Okay. ¿Por qué te cuesta esto? ¿Por qué aún fallas en esto? ¿Por qué no practicaste? ¿Cómo lo corregís? Agarré el presente simple el lunes. Agarrá la tercera área de oportunidad que les voy a señalar hoy el pasado simple el pasado simple ¿por qué se te dificulta? entonces hace algo hace positivo o negativo pregunta quienes han estado conmigo ya saben esto es una dieta diaria que puedes hacer positivo o negativo pregunta la mis el mismo verbo hacerlo en presente simple el lunes el martes agarras pasado simple el miércoles agarras presente perfecto es decir, el tiempo gramatical que más te cuesta, lo atacas. Agendate, ¿sí? Agarra algo como, no se ve, no se ve esa cosa. En la Texaco estaban regalando eh, estos calendarios, no sé si lo logran ver. Es un planner y pues ahí cada día, ¿no? Cada día vas viendo, cada día tenés un recuadro donde puedes tú eh, básicamente organizarte. Eso es todo. Es cuestión de organizarse nada más. Entonces, cada día un tiempo gramatical diferente, agarras cinco verbos, trata de incluir cinco palabras nuevas. Y empezás, positivo, negativo, pregunta, primer verbo. Siguiente verbo, positivo, negativo, pregunta, solo es para que, tú, para que tú recordes cómo era la estructura de eso. Ocupa colores, a tu cerebro le encantan los colores. Ok, that's it. Okay. ¿Querés mejorar en inglés? 
do something. Ya no puedes estar con que solo vas a venir a la clase a las dos horas, que en realidad las dos horas se convierten en qué, una hora y media, hora, ok. So, y más a este punto que todo es hablar de temas bien específicos, ok. So, before I choose two people, any questions? ¿Alguna pregunta con lo que acabo de decir? No. No. Yes. You're free to do what you want to do. Come on, guys. Nobody? You have been clear. You have been clear. <laughs> you have been clear, sir. Okay, perfect. Let me do the attendance really quick so we can move on. This is the second attendance. Okay, Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Dora Elizabeth Flores Méndez. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Erwin, ok, Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Fredis Vladimir Cortés López. I'm here, teacher. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present, teacher. Thank you. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Present teacher. Thank you. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present teacher. Thank you. Welcome back. Luis Thank Ernesto you. Romero Argueta. Present teacher. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. Thank you. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Excellent. Jessica Yanari Cortez Díaz. I'm here. Thank you. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Suleyma Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Coyer Albanés. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Thelma Cleotilde Peña Martinez. Present teacher. Excellent. Okay. And one more thing. If you need help, just text me. If you think you need any idea on how to improve any area of improvement, you know, in a small area, you can do that. Uh, somebody raise the hand. Francisco Amadeo, tell me. Yes, teacher. You mentioned me. Did I did I mention you? Did you mention me? Yes, I think I did. Oh, okay. Yep, there you are. Got you. Okay, okay. thank you. You're welcome. So really quick, I have five minutes for this, but I will take only two minutes. Really quick, please pay attention. If you doubt or have any question about what I'm about to tell you, let me know if I'm going too fast as well. So there are six different types of e-commerce. The first one is business to consumer. Easy, right? Business to consumer. So what is this? Business to consumer is the regular type of um, e-commerce that you know. Anywhere you look, it's always present, you know. And it's what we know. You go to a business online and easily if I ask you, hey, mention to me three online businesses, you will easily tell me, for example. Amazon. Amazon, mm, yeah. Business to consumer. eBay. Mm -hmm. eBay. Business uh... to consumer. Yeah. Pizza Hut. <laughs> what? Pizza Hut. <laughs> pizza Hut. <laughs> AliExpress. Yeah. yeah. Pizza Hut. Yeah. Super Lady. Selectos. Lady Shops. Huh? Lady Shops. But that is uh, it's most common in, in Spain. <laughs> in Spain? Lady Shops? Yes. 
Mm. Okay, so that's the idea. That's basically it. You know, it's very simple. I just send you an image with these details, and it's very logic. Let's say it's just to think about it logically. So that's business to consumer, B two C. Okay, B two C. Business to business. What is business to business? A business selling another business. But how does that happen? And you see it, you see it, but sometimes you don't even think about it. If you go back to the chain of distribution, to the distribution channels, you will remember this. A clear example of business to business is Walmart. Walmart not only sells to consumers, Walmart sells products of <laughs> a whole lot of brands to consumers. So Walmart is what? A distributor. Uh, distribution? Distribution. <laughs> the distribution channel. They are distributors. The, the distribution channel, yeah. They are distributors, remember? Yeah. yeah. Are they wholesale or retail stores? Retail store. Mm. <laughs> Man, or maybe yeah. both. It's both, right? But yeah, yeah. that's a wholesaler. <laughs> They're because, wholesalers. Yeah, huh? because a retailer that would be like a small, like someone that's trying to get there uh, to be a wholesaler, to be a small company. You I want to buy to to sell it like for a higher price to get their their allowance of Totally, you got it. Yeah. Okay. So, but in this term, I want you to understand business to business is a business selling other businesses products. For example, name, give me five brands that you can you find said, in Walmart. We gave her an example yesterday, um, Alibaba that sells to, to um, what was oh, the other? To Amazon. Amazon. Yeah. So, <laughs> we will get there. We will get there. We will get there. But let's think about Walmart. Name, give me, give me five brands that you can find in Walmart. LG. LG. Samsung. Samsung. Okay, we went through the electronics part. Okay. Oh, Fisher Price. Fisher Price. Uh, it's like the, the 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 brand of the of the toys. Toys and yeah. Uh huh. Uh, Kimberly Clark. Kimberly Clark. That's huge. Mm -hmm. What else? What? Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Yeah. So Walmart is a business. They sell products from other businesses. Mm, a little bit confusing. Consumer to consumer. What do you think about it? What is that option? Consumer to consumer. <laughs> Second hand. Is the market in Facebook? The oh, marketplace? Yeah. Yeah. Totally. That's like the marketplace. And some other places that are selling, as uh, Alexander said, secondhand products. You could think about it as secondhand yeah. products. Consumer, yeah, to consumer, for example, is a. Uh, It'll be clothing. Uh, in El Salvador, Peru, yeah. Mm. Uber. Mm. What do you think, guys? No. And, and look at the chart. Look at the chart that I send you on WhatsApp. Huh. Think about it. Yeah, consumer to consumer. Let's think about it as I have this guitar. I want to sell this guitar, so I look for a place to sell it. And nowadays, I just post it on Facebook. I just go on Marketplace. I go to 24, no, I don't know what, what's the name of that thing. And it's a national website, a Salvadorian website to sell things 24 seven. I don't know what's the name. So well, <laughs> does that even exist? Is there still? <laughs> well, like, no. Yes, yes, yes but the uh, well, like, has, has a new, new image. It has a new image. They have uh, an image. Yes. Uh, All the, 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 the white page was Schengen. Schengen. 
changed. 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 <laughs> Final sounds. Changed. Difficult. Changed. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Consumer to business. Hmm. Consumer to business. What do you think about it? I don't know, but if you are one time, uh, well, I don't know if I can say that, but in this, well, one time, uh, Igor called me to give some ideas to you more the, the text message because I was a, a consumer that don't, don't use that. But I don't know how to say it. Uh, well, I, I, don't, I don't use uh, text message. So Tigo called me to help them how to, I don't know if, if that's right. And if I had the idea of that, but that's only came, that's only came up my mind. I don't know. Uh, that's, I don't know if, if that, is, that is a good example of this. But uh, uh, the, in our country, for example, the the famous TikTokers or something like that sells the what's the name of the services. people? What's the name of that people? Influencers. Thank you, Stefania. Yes, you got it for influencers. YouTubers, suppose, <laughs> the, <famous>. suppose <laughs> the so called, the so called YouTubers. Amos, I'm sorry, go back. Influencers in, in, in the in the net, in the network, in the web, on websites, yeah. on the internet, on the internet, on the internet. Yes, influencers became famous when someone I don't know who started naming brands on their channels. So first they got a lot of followers, right? Their followers increased, their subscribers increased. And then they thought about, they thought about, they thought about uh, taking advantage of that and starting talking. Hey guys, I want to talk to you about the Samsung cell phone that just came here. You know, today they send me, and this is the key. They send me this cell phone so I could I could try it. It has four cameras. I mean, and that's the first thing you do nowadays. You go and check the review of a famous YouTuber, you know, to get the idea. So that's a consumer selling the product of a business. As they they are show show the products uh, for the companies. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like the invisible right. bottles, remember the invisible bottles? Yeah. yeah, exactly. So they promote they promote the product. That's it. Okay, um, but, but it's a service. It's, uh, a service. It's a service, yes. But in the end, it's like when you you get paid. You feel um, survey. <laughs> a survey. A yeah. survey. Feedback. Or sometimes. There are some pages that you are a tester and you try or test some product or mm -hmm. or game mm -hmm. and they pay to you, pay you. A no, they pay to you, that's okay. They pay, pay to you. To you. Mm -hmm. uh, only for, for test the product. Only to test the product. Remember, to yes. verb for to noun, to mm -hmm. verb for Noun. Got it. Okay. Exactly, Alexander. You're totally right. Okay, let's move on. Business to government. Business to government. That's clear, is simple. A business selling to the government because the government doesn't produce products, you know, so that's a great business actually. But everything <laughs> For example, you know what? I, know. I was thinking about this yesterday. Who is producing bitcoins? Mm. No, that's not producing. No, you, you need to mine the bitcoins. They're mining. That's a business. 
but they are not selling. The government is producing energy to mine. Mining Bitcoin. They're mining Bitcoins. So mm -hmm. yes, it's a business, but it's not, yeah, well, I don't know. We have to deep think about it. Okay. So that, that's clear, right? How do you say licitación in English? Mr. Google. Licitation. A what? Tender. Tender. Litation. Thank you. Oh, Erika was faster than Google. Woo! No, I use that word uh, a lot with the okay. providers. I know because of your studies as well. No, it's just that we have Google. Google, say hello to the audience. Okay, that's our Google. Yeah, when, when we need a new word, you know, or we need help with a word that we don't remember or know what's the meaning, that's Fernando. Okay, Mr. Google, you're gonna be Mrs. Google then. That's good. <laughs> okay. okay, and the last one. Sign the... Google. Good. Sign Google. Sign Google. Google, yeah. Sign hey, Google. the last one. Mobile, mobile commerce. Mobile commerce or M commerce. There is where, who was talking about? Pedidos ya. Pedidos ya, Hugo. Right? Those are apps. Apps on your cell phone. Man, I just downloaded Hugo one of these days. Every Saturday, I play the guitar at church. I'm catecumeno. So I play the guitar. And the thing is that after, after church, we finish. Uh, well, right now, due to COVID, we are ending the, the service at about 6.20, 6.30. The thing is that we go with our family with my family, we, we always tried to go eating something, right? And so one day I downloaded Ugo and I noticed they had a, a nice promotion at this place. Um, my, my son loved it. It's in, oh my God, Boulevard del Hipódromo is a Chinese place. God, Chinese food, they have koi. Chinese? No, 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 koi fishes. They have koi fish. Oh, I said fishes. I said fishes. Koi fish. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't, doesn't exist. Okay. Don Lee. What? Don Lee. Don Lee. Yeah, Don Lee. <laughs> I think that's the name. Man, the food was good, but the place was amazing. They had a lot of fish, you know, swimming. I touched a fish. I played with a fish that was amazing. And the fish followed me. I was like, whoa. <laughs> So we always try to look for places and this app is good. You know, the Google app, you just open it and they have good offers. Well, I'm becoming an influencer right now. Don't pay attention. Uh, that's the point. <laughs> so apps, what other apps are famous in our country? And this is on your book, by the way, this is part of your book on page 9, 10, 11. Page 11. Uber. This is Uber. Okay. Uber, Uber Eats, no app, on, on life app, Pedido Ya. Uh, mm -hmm. Drive. In Driver. Uh, in Driver. In Driver. In drive. What else? What else? What else? Uh, now. Okay, you know, now. Now. Now app. Now yeah. app. What is that? Yeah, well. Always delivery? Yeah. Delivery service? Yes, delivery service. Yes, yeah, delivery service. Uh, Super Selectos app. Really? Yeah. Los tengo. I was about to Is that ask. Insurance? Select uh, an app. Yes, the uh, China web app. Okay. Le app. Starbucks. Price Mars app. Pizza what? Hut. Cinepolis. Cinepolis. Wow. There are many. Pizza Hut. Okay, Thelma. They have apps. Mercado. Oh, oh, oh. Thelma. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> La Joya app. Yeah. Do you have an app? <laughs> no? Yes. Yes, you have an app. Yes, a little, a little in construction. It's in construction. Oh my yes. God. Good yes. job. That's amazing. You can see the different styles, right? Yes. For the glasses. Yes. Armed. Yes. Amazing. And brands, many brands. Can I give you an idea? Uh, Selma? Gucci, Gucci, for example. Gucci, uh -huh. Gucci, Gucci. Yeah. Um, 
Thelma, um, tell, tell them to, I don't know, think about it. You could add the graduation of your lenses, your lenses graduation, just type it as a customer. I will expect this from your app. Type your graduation, select your uh, rings, I don't know, your, right? The type of lens glasses that you want from a list and check the prices. Yes, in our, in our website and in, in our page, there are many, many options. And in actually, is in construction, uh, this option when uh, when you uh, if you want or need uh, any any style, it depends your face. Depends on your uh, face. Depend your um, your graduation. If you need a blue ray, for example, mm. uh, yes, and. Uh, do you do you need a a date with or anything? Yeah. Uh huh. An appointment. Okay, appointment. Yes. <laughs> they no, no. Excuse me. <laughs> That's why you love me. I know because I remember. I remember when you uh, wanted to say something, Thelma. Remember when you were my student before? When when you wanted to say something, I used to guess what you were thinking room <laughs> yeah, yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah and so marvin arrived uh, in our in our in in our principal in the principal store mm -hmm. and uh now actually we are friends so sales so and and uh, uh well, and, well uh, mm -hmm. so, uh, wing, I don't know, and uh, uh, well, with with Marvin, and uh, uh, he buys um, a good good brand. Hmm. I remember that uh, um, they have actually they uh, uh, he he had a he had a and uh, adidas yeah okay there are adidas glasses wow that's yes. really nice that's the thing about la jolla you can find different brands you know and that's another factor from many e-commerce um stores any e-stores where you can as erica said you know you have so many options to choose from but yeah. some some uh, physical stores like La Jolla, for example, in this case, um, they do have a lot of options, which is not normal nowadays. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we saw six yes. different types of e-commerce, e-businesses, let's say. Okay. Uh, well, you have answered these questions. Let's do this together, okay? So we can speed up things a little bit. We have a set of terms. Can you see my screen? Yes. Yes. Is it blurry or faded? No? No. OK. No. OK, so what is selection? I'm just going to read this for the record, OK? Just for the video. So we have selection, instant gratification. Pay attention gratification this is amazing instant Grat gratification gratification gratification, gratification. You, oh, okay. you could say gratification but that's more british remember una t entre dos vocales ri, 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 ri. una t entre dos vocales ri, 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 ri. gratification not in this case shen shen okay hmm I O N education gratification. Okay, deals, deals, infinite, deals. infinite shelves, infinite shelves, and I repeat, shelves, shelves, 
okay? Infinite shelves. Brick and mortar store. Mortar, mortar store. Hmm. Google brick and mortar store. Okay. Brick and mortar store. That's odd. Okay. The virtually unlimited, unlimited, unlimited extent and range, range of products available in e-commerce stores, e-commerce stores. Termino un sonido S, comienzo otro sonido S, no hago una pausa. Commerce stores, e-commerce stores. No voy a decir e-commerce stores, mm -mm. e-commerce stores. A traditional business that deals with its customers face-to-face -face in an office or store, or store, store, okay? That deals with its customers, that deals with its customers, that deals with its customers. That's the way you have to practice. Así tenés que practicar. That deals with its customers, that deals with its customers face-to-face -face in an office or store. Having a wide range of products from which customers can choose the desire, desire to experience fulfillment without delay. The desire to experience fulfillment without delay. When a website offers products for sale. Okay, take a minute. Breathe. Google, what is brick and mortar store? Eh, lo traduce literalmente como tiene ladrillo y mortero. Hmm. Ok. Ser Fine. interpretado es como una tienda física en general. Dice. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's like a physical store. <laughs> ok. So, what is number five? The, the brick and mortar store is a, is a, uh, a place. A traditional business. A traditional no. business. That deals okay. with its customers. A traditional business that deals with its customers. That deals with it. That deals with its. That deals with its. Me, me cuesta a mí pronunciar esa, esa, esa oración. That deals with its customers. That deals with its customers face to face. Cuando te cuesta una oración y sentir que te trabajas mucho, dividir en partes. A traditional business, a traditional business that deals with its customers. A traditional business that deals, uh, a traditional business that deals with its customers face to face in an office or store. En inglés real, chicos, no es necesario leer corrido. No es lo importante. Lo importante es la articulación adecuada de lo que estás diciendo. Okay, keep going. Number four. The virtual the unlimited, virtual, yeah, unlimited extent. Virtual, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'll go with you. So that's number four. Okay, what's number three? Deals. When the website offers products for sale. Hmm. I guess. El público. Yeah, what do you think, guys? I agree. You agree? Yes, I agree. I agree. Three? Okay, good. What's number two? Having a white panel. The desire to experience. The desire. <laughs> the desire to experience. That's, that's funny for me because it's true. It's true. I'll tell you about it in a minute. Okay, so number one is having a wide range of products from which customers can choose. Selection. A big selection of products. Okay, so the desire to experience fulfillment without delay. Okay, ¿Quieres aprender inglés rápido y engordar un poquito? <laughs> Puede ser fruta o algo, okay? Lo que más te gusta. A ver, Amos, ¿qué es lo que más te encanta a ti de, de comer? The Mexican food. <laughs> Menos mal que no dijo cerveza. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> okay. Cuando sientas que estás empieza a practicar inglés, okay, en tu casa y todo. Okay. Sentís que haces algo? 
y decís, wow, si logro hacer esto, si logro leer este párrafo de cinco líneas, sin comas ni puntos, y lo leo perfecto como lo estoy escuchando, oh, me voy a gratificar, ¿ok? Con una torta, con una torta de una noche. <laughs> so, that's the way. It's gratification okay. is having gratification. the desire to experience fulfillment without delay. Right now. I want it right now. Okay? And that's what video games do on your brain. You know, you get, you pass the level. Man, that's awesome. Okay? You fail. Oh. Okay. Good. Okay. This is very clear, right? So, number one. Selection, you have a wide range of products. Good. Instant gratification, 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 instant gratification. Okay. Fulfillment without delay. I want it now. I want my product right now. Okay. That's instant gratification. Um, and that this is what happens when you go to Amazon and you're looking for a specific item you're looking for a set of headsets okay you're looking for a collectible you're looking for collectibles from from marvel studios you know something that you really want and you haven't found in any other website you go to amazon and you find it and you go like oh my god i got it i made the purchase like black friday for example crazy okay deals hmm tell me about it who doesn't have neil deals nowadays um can you mention to me one deal of this week that you saw somewhere back to school back to school every supermarket in Salvador right now 50 percent, or i don't know more mm -hmm. Open English. <laughs> Fire. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, Rodriguez, I want to talk to you. I'm sorry. Linares, come here. Oops. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, boss. Little mistake. Uh huh. Something else? Yeah. Deals. Everybody has deals. Inf infinite shelves. That's mm, remarkable. The virtually unlimited extent and range of products available in e-commerce stores. Do you think it's unlimited? Is there something you have never found on a website like Amazon or eBay? You know, sometimes they, they don't have, <laughs> they don't have the product and it's stuck. Oh, they're out of stock, but they did have the product and they may find it right. Maybe this discontinued products sometimes. Sometimes they have this discontinued, discontinued, difficult word, discontinued products. Okay. Brick and mortar stores. Yeah. As Thelma said, every physical store. You got it. Any questions? No observations, opinions, suggestions. No. Okay. So uh, do you have a little job right now? This is very simple. This is page what? 10. Okay, page 10 on your book. Section five. Okay. Read and label the statements below. What are they describing? Advantages or disadvantages of e-commerce? You need an A, okay, for advantages and D for disadvantages. Shall we do it together? Let me see. Yeah, let's do it together. Um, I need your help, Yuri. Uh -huh. Okay, teacher. Okay, may, may you read, please? Will you read? Um, the number one. Mm -hmm. More reach to customer. There are no geographic limitations. Anyone good or bad can oh, wait, wait. <laughs> So just number one. More reach to customers. 
there are no geographic limitations. What do you think, guys? Is that an advantage or disadvantage? Advantage. 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 Okay. It's an advantage. Okay, I'm going to open this thing again. Here. If you haven't downloaded the latest version of PDF, it's very useful. Okay. More rich to customers. Mm, that sounds weird, right? More rich to customers. Mm, a better approach. Or, well, anyways. Okay. Next, uh, Jessica. Number two. Anyone, good or, or bad? can easily start a business. Advantage or disadvantage? Advantage. Mm. Mm. Is this a bad thing? Can be good, it can be bad. <laughs> it depends. Yeah. Hey. It depends. No. It's good or bad. Good or bad is, is, a, is a disadvantage. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. disadvantage guys can you remind me of synonyms for this phrase because many of you are using this phrase it depends and depends it's up to it's up to is one of my favorites it's up to the situation you know it's up to the person who starts the business it's up to you i can remember think about others uh -huh. in my opinion is a disadvantage for the death of the bank if uh, the person uh, 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 you mean if the person know. if the person is a thief 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 yeah the person is a thief you know they're bad intention people you know uh what else thief so yeah this could be both okay let's say both uh, yeah. But it's what both. is the meaning? What is the meaning of good or bad? Good or bad person, or good or bad with technologies? Anyone, good or bad? Para bien o para mal, just escribe. For me, it's an advantage because it says is this... anyone can easily start a business. Easily, yeah. It's like for good or for bad, you know, anyone can easily start a business. I mean, an eighty-year-old men or women you know they, they could start a business uh even kids kids can start the business a kid became youtuber by by criticizing the toys I, it remind me of this for our everybody i think it was Mar mattel toys he used to go and buy every single toy of mattel and he uploaded a video trying testing the the, the products you know the toys and the kid became viral. He, he became a, a famous little kid, you know, earning money on YouTube because he had millions of views. That was crazy. Yeah, so he made his own business. Okay. Let me show you an example. In the United, in the United States, there's a new trend there is a trend in the States right now. Everybody is talking about Karens. Do you know what are Karens? No? No. Owner uh, of the cat. Yes. No, not, in, not anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, not That's... anymore. It's not anymore the owner of the cat. Now it's a toxic, a toxic person. It could Probably be a name, but usually, usually are toxic neighbors mm. I always misspell this word toxic neighbors but that's the idea mm. there's a t no t i can i always misspell this word toxic neighbors you know they're complaining about the noise in your house complaining about everything so they call them karens okay so these guys there are some guys on tiktok starting their business they are creating shirts with a slogan you know a phrase about karen's 
to be occurring. What? Don't be occurring. Don't be occurring. That's right. Don't be occurring. Right? And they're creating uh, all these outfits, you know, and it's a trend. And they go on TikTok. Hey, buy my product, buy my stuff, you know, support my channel. My God, they make a lot of money. Good. Next, customer loyalty is not always guaranteed. Customers, customer loyalty is not always guaranteed. What do you think? Advantage, disadvantage. Disadvantage. Totally. Totally. Okay, continue, Thelma. Four. Okay. Number four, <coughs> low operational cost and better quality of service. Services. Services. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Oh, services. Yeah. It's okay. Yes. It's okay. Services. Okay. What do you think? Disadvantage or advantage? Advantage. Advantage. Yeah. 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 It's advantage. Mm -hmm. Better quality of services. Mm -hmm. Don't hesitate. <laughs> sometimes. Sometimes, right? Jocelyn, number five. Easy to start and manage a business. Easy to start. Is it a start? Is it? A, is it? A, hey, I love that. Is it a start? Is it? Is it? Is it a start? Is it a start? There you go. Is it a start and manage a business? Okay. What is it? Advantage or disadvantage? Advantage. 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 It's, advantage. It's, it's, yeah. It's advantage. similar to number three, right? No, what number two? Very similar. And the last one. Francisco. Yes, teacher. There are no sales when the website is down. Sales. Repeat. Sales. Sales. Sorry. Sales. 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 Mm -hmm. There are no sales when the website is down. Advantage or disadvantage? Disadvantage. It's disadvantage. But nowadays, do you think a website will go down? Yeah. Still, yeah. Maybe. <laughs> is a, it is a, prob, a common problem. It is a common problem. Repeat. It's a common thing. It's a common thing. It's a common thing. It's yeah. a common thing. Yeah. It's a common thing. Okay. Write a 10 line paragraph about the two advantages. No. Let's go into today's topic for once, just to clear this out a little bit before we finish. Um, so we were talking about how many online businesses operating in our country can you name? We were talking about Uber, about uh, online businesses, online businesses. And look at this. I, I love this question. I like this question because it refers to what we were talking about. Are there e-commerce businesses, businesses doing business only through phone apps? Only through phone apps. Hmm. Yeah, we said it, right? Uber, in-driver. But other than delivery, are there any businesses doing business only through phone apps, just like eBay? Uh, in Mercandu. In El Salvador? Yes. What? Really? Can you pay? Uh, but uh, they bring the product from USA. From the USA. From the USA, really? Yes. yes. And they uh, uh, deliver your products on your house. You know what? <clears throat> Can you share the link? Yes. <laughs> that sounds like Aeropostal. It's, it, yes, but maybe that is better because, well, I don't, I don't know how it works uh, Aeropostal. I don't know how it works. Just I don't know bad. how Aeropostal works. Uh -huh. The Mercandu even uh, has, uh, uh, how do you say, quotas? Down. Fees. With, fees. with credit cards. No, fees fees. With credit. they have monthly payments. Yes, with uh, zero interest. 
with no interest. And yeah, 12, 12 month payment, payment by, man, I forgot that. Okay, I got you, I got you. Hmm. I'll look for it, share the link. Yes, what's up? Or, or here? <laughs> yeah, through our WhatsApp group. Now ah, we, don't, okay. we won't be able to see it here. Okay, so yeah, we talked about the six different types of um, e-commerce or e-businesses, right? Can you remember what were those? <laughs> what was the first one? Mm. Business to? To, cons to consumer. To consumer, okay. Consumer. <laughs> business to consumer. What's the second one? Business to business. Business to business, okay. Uh huh. Third one? Consumer, consumer to business. Consumer, consumer, consumer to business. Fourth? Uh, to consumer to consumer. Huh? Consumer to consumer. Mm. Yeah, that, that was like the used product, right? Uh huh. Fifth? Consumer business to government. To consumer. To government and the last one, mobile commerce. Uh huh. Mobile commerce. So here on your book, you only have platform, mobile commerce, local e-commerce, auctions, and bids. Hmm. Hmm. Auctions and bids. Hmm. I don't know, Rick. It sounds fake. Looks fake. I don't know. Look, auctions. Bids. Bids. That what is the meaning of auctions? Auctions is is like you bet, you you offer, you offer, and if you win, you know, if you're the last one, it's like copart, you know, where you can buy cars, used cars in the states. That's an auction. Okay, we're going for 10, we're going for 10. Who wants 10, 10, 10, 15? I got 15, I got 15. Who wants 20, 20, 20, 20, 20? Give me 20, give me 20, 25, 25, 25. No. <laughs> That's an auction. It's like in eBay. <laughs> really? You can yeah. go on auction? Yeah. Mm. But what is that? You can bid? offer for many products, for example, earbuds, yeah. PlayStation, so oh, like that. I didn't know that. Okay. We only have seven minutes for this. Let's do it together, okay? If you find one, you think you got the right answer, let me know. Platform. It's a software application that's allowed online business to manage but sales and operation. A platform. What do you think, guys? It is a software yeah. application that allows online businesses to manage their website, sales, and operations. Okay. It's a platform. It's a platform? Okay. Mm -hmm. I agree with you. Okay. So that will be A. B. B. <laughs> the same line. Same line? Read it. M commerce. Electronic commerce conducted on mobile phones. Commerce. Okay. Someone else? Auctions is a public sale in which goods or property are sold to the highest bidder. Excellent. So that will be auctions, letter D. Okay. Local e-commerce. A kind of e-commerce focus of the customer's geographical location. Mm -hmm. Hey, this sounds so interesting. Local e-commerce. A kind of e-commerce focused Difficult word, focused, 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 focused um, on the consumer's geographical location. Yep. Yeah. Mister. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I guess E is the first one. Bids. Um, is the yeah. offering of a price. Based on, based, a based on your example. <laughs> Especially at an auction. 
No, no, no. And the first one, a public sale in which goods or property are yeah. sold to the highest yeah, bid. It's, no. it's the offering of price of a price. Come again, Erika, I think. Bids is the offering of a price, especially in auction. Stephanie. Oh, yeah, sure. Stephanie. Thank you. Yes, that's sure. the bid. I couldn't remember. I, I knew I heard the term before. Yeah, the, the, but... because on the auction, go to go to Copart or IAAI, and you will see that it says current bid. Current bid. So bids, correct me if I'm wrong, Mr. Google, but bid is a puesta, right? It's like offer. It's a synonym for offer or a puesta. BID. 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 Yeah, just bid. Yeah, for the reason I told you, the highest bidder. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it is a kind of e commerce. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's it is a kind of offer. It's an no, offer, right? Yeah. Uh huh. Especially in a, at an auction. Hey, especially at a at an auction, at an auction, at an auction, at an auction. Uh, okay, just an focus auction. at an auction. <laughs> you got it? At an auction. Okay. And this is what we talked about. Consumer to consumer, business to business, consumer to business, business to consumer. This may be in your platform. Who has checked the platform, guys? Have you seen the platform? Not yet. Not, Not yet. yet. Not yes. yet. Erika, yeah. Is this on the platform? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. It's just for let's see, consumer to consumer, C to C. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> Uh, I think it's number two, right? I mean, this the line is here, but yeah, yeah. This this will be like C to C, right? Transactions conducted directly mm -hmm. between a company and consumers who are the end the end users of its products or services. Okay, give me number one. We only have four minutes for this activity. Yes. Business to business is the number one. Yeah. Okay. It refers to businesses that is the business that is conducted between companies rather rather than rather than between a company and individual consumers. Yeah. B2B. Business to business. Okay. Transactions go with. Okay. What's number three and what's number four? The number three. It's customer to cost to consumer. Customer to consumer. No, consumer to consumer is the number three, I guess. It is a business model that facilitates an environment, usually online, where customers can trade with each other. It's consumer to consumer. Why did because I put number, number two here? Is wait, wait. Transactions yeah, between that, company and, and consumer. This, this was my mistake. Wait a minute. It's B to C. Number yeah, two. I, I made a mistake. I'm sorry. I made a boo boo. Yeah, B, B to C, and this will be C to C. C to C. You got it. Thank you, Stephanie. Uh huh. And so number four. <laughs> C2B. 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 It is when a large number of individuals make their services or products available for purchase for companies seeking pricely these types of services of products. Mm, it is when a large number of individuals make their services or products available for purchase for companies seeking pricely, precisely, I'm sorry, precisely these types of services or products. You know, there is a trend with this. Actually, we had it wrong. 
So this is consumer to business, right? C to B. Okay, there was a misconception. Um, there is a trend right now. Many companies, it's exactly what we're talking about. The trend right now is companies are looking for developers. Fernando can talk to you about it. Fernando develops apps or software, I think. No, apps, right? Yes. Uh -huh. uh, the, the both. 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 So if you have a company, let's say you have to look for people like Fernando to develop an app or a website. And that is a trend. And many companies are looking for well prepared people, you know, in programming, especially. So that is a guy, a consumer selling knowledge to the company. And it's very specific very specific because the company goes like, okay, I need this, this, and this in the app. And you have to build it. Okay. That's expensive. In the end, knowledge is expensive. Okay, guys, I hope you, you liked it. I hope you liked the class. Please uh, watch the video again. You can go to YouTube if you want to go back to the reading section, understand the class better. Okay. And tomorrow, bring some questions to the class, you know, or opinions to your classmates. Let's do the attendance one more time. And I'm staying tonight with Andres Giovanni Valdivieso. 10 minutes, okay? Okay. Thank you. So I'm going with Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Good night. Good night. We're missing two minutes. Don't leave yet. Andres Giovanni okay. Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Madeo Villacorta Chávez. Present teacher. Fredis Vladimir Cortez López. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Eimos Alfredo García Granadino. Present teacher. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present teacher. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. Here. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night. Good night. Roberto Luis Sumaño Orellana. Suleyma Ivón Moreno Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present teacher. Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you. Okay, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. I'm just staying with the dress. Take care tomorrow at eight o'clock. Take care. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Tomorrow. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Okay, let me just a minute. Okay, so how are you, Andres? Can you hear the noise? No. No? Okay. No. Good. So how's it going? It's I'm, going. I'm a little sleepy. Oh, really? Why? Yes. I drink uh, a tea before the class. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Yes, hey, but... tell me about your Christmas. Uh, it was with family. Uh -huh. The both days. One day with uh, 
my family, my family, and one day with my wife. Mm -hmm. That's what we do too. Mm -hmm. Which day do you spend with your family? Christmas or New Year's Eve? New Year's Eve. Uh -huh. With your family? Yes, with my family. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, the same thing happens with mine. Um, with we spend Christmas with my family because, you know, the religious thing, and we do some. Mm -hmm. Read rituals. We do some rituals for the kids, and and in um, New Year's Eve is more like weird, you know, more like party and everything. <laughs> it's different. Yes, you're right. Did, did you uh, rest? Sir, did you rest? Did you have some vacation on that uh, week? Yes, I I have uh, ten days free. Whoa. And you? No, I actually worked. I worked on December 25th and January the 1st. Yeah, both days. And then they moved me back here to my house. You know, I'm working from home again. And I only worked two days from home. And then I went on vacations on the 13th. Let me see. June. June. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, on the, on the 15th, January 15th, I went on vacations. I'm coming back to the call center on Tuesday, February the 1st. Mm. Yeah, 17 days with no it, call center. It's correct to say due to COVID. Due to COVID, due, due to COVID, COVID, due to COVID, you work at home or not? No, 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 no. no. They they just decided to send me back home. You know, to continue mm. working from home. Oh, okay. Thank God. It's better for you. Yeah, yeah. I mean, driving at four thirty a.m., coming back at one p.m. on the traffic at at noon. You know, ah. And fuel is very expensive now. And fuel, yes, fuel. I'm saving fuel. Mm -hmm. And I mean, being at home is awesome, working from home, mm -hmm. it's but, a lot better. But your, your car is uh, have a, has a small motor? A small engine? Yes, engine, yes. a small engine is 1.1, it's a 1.1 mm -hmm. engine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very small. Yes. Yeah, you're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Not too much because it got broke, you know. It got broke. So I, I just repair it. And things happen for a reason. They send me back on the 15th. And on the 18th, I send the car to the repair shop. And I just got it back yesterday. So I'm okay. That was over a week, actually. And... Now I'm repairing it, small details here from home. I think I will paint it by myself. I don't know. You can do it? No, I never did that uh. before. <laughs> <laughs> but the same thing, I, I never changed um, any part on a car, but I, I, I did it today, you know. It was the first time I did it and it was really good. YouTube. <laughs> okay, you say, you say money. Yeah, I saved a lot of money. That's true. But uh, uh, you have difficult to to find the spare parts for your car. Is it difficult to find the spare parts? Mm, some of them, yes. Mm -hmm. That's because the the oil pump, you know, the oil pump that throws the oil upwards. Mm -hmm. I didn't find it. Couldn't find it. Mm -hmm. So I just clean the one on the car and leave it there. Yeah, but it's going well. It's it's running. It's, it's going to work for another five, 10 years. Depend on how, depends on how I use it. But tell me about you. What has been interesting in your life during this month? No, but not too much things. Not too many no, things, okay. No many things. Not too many things. Remember, plural, too many things. Too many or you things. can just say not too much. 
Not too much. Uh -huh. not, not much. Not much. That's that's better. Uh, okay, let's talk about your future. What what are your plans for this new year? Maybe. ¿Cómo se remodel? Remodelar algo. Um, renew. Renew. Uh -huh. I have. I have some things pending to do in my house. So I, I think to, to do it this year, but I don't know. <laughs> you have no idea. Uh, uh, everything. Uh, all the things are very expensive now. Yes, yes, mm -hmm. they are. But my advice is do it by yourself. You know what I did? My kid, my 12 years old, wanted to change his room. He, he's, he's drawing, he's drawing. So he, he wanted me to, to buy a desk, a drawing desk, like for architects and put some lights, you know? So man, I, I modified, I improved his room. I cut the closet because the closet has some doors on the top, you know, you can slide the doors. Mm -hmm. So, and underneath the doors, you have the two doors, the two main doors. And, and those are made of wood. Yeah, so they're made of wood. So I removed the wood and just left the top side. Okay, I removed the closet and move it inside the room. And then I bought wood, I cut the wood, I painted with um, this thing, how do you call it? Barniz? I, I forgot the word. Yeah, I just painted. You no, know, it was amazing. I mean, now he has the closet and he has a small space with a desk and the lights. I mean, and I made the, the electronic connections and, and then he goes like, now I need a fan. So I bought a fan and I put it on the on the ceiling and I didn't know how to install these rotative fans, you know, on the ceiling. Mm -hmm. yeah. Man, that was really difficult, but I made it. I just looked for a video on YouTube on how to install it and I followed step by step. That was yeah. amazing. Yeah. Yes, uh, with YouTube, you can see many tutorials, tutorials. Mm -hmm. Yes, and it's tutorials. very helpful. Yeah, yes. so that's my advice. Don't spend money on paying someone to do it. It's very, you can have fun. You can have fun doing things at home. Yes. Right. Uh, hey, nice. do, they, do they give you 10 days? And then 10 days, like 20 days a year? Or do you also have 15 days yearly? No, I just have the 10 days for Christmas and then one week for all the week, all the week. And August, in August, August we have um, August. an additional week. Mm. And at the beginning of December, we have three, three days more for the, the fiestas patronal. Okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's awesome. Uh -huh. Okay, and that's another way of taking vacations. Well, yes. it's good to have you back. If you need anything, just text me on WhatsApp, okay? Okay, okay teacher, thanks Take for care. your help. Good night. Good night.